Alright, welcome ladies and gentlemen to another Discord League match. Or, sorry, not Discord League. Uh, World Cup match. We have the rubber match between the USA and Singapore for the, uh, you know, to be the first 2-0 of their group. Uh, group 4, uh, you know, winning this match here would take a, a strong lead for making it out of group stage. Currently tied 1-1. We have Travis versus Nyx, uh, Phoenix versus Scorpion. And looks like Travis has won the die roll and elected to go second, as everyone does. A bit low on volume. Oh, alright. How about now? Hey, what's up, Eric? What's up, Phoenix Fox? Is it good now? Alright, we see uh, Travis buying Master of Gisei Toshi with 3 Fate, versus Nyx buying Miyako 3 Fate. Nyx does not have the ability to play Forge Edict at the moment. Oh yeah, I actually haven't zoomed it at all. I This is my normal zoom. I full screened it and then didn't zoom, like a smart person. We see a Goblin Seek take Travis's last Fate. However, Travis is seeker, is seeker of Air, so he's able to get Fate where he might not normally be able to. And he does have a Palace on turn 1. What ring did Travis name with? He named Earth Ring with Master of Gisei Toshi. And we see it, we see it hit, uh, hitting Manicure Garden. So this is a huge difference between, um... <clears throat> Between Seeker and Keeper, if this was Keeper Keeper uh, of Water, Travis would only have one Fate. Travis is going to get two Fate from this Manicure Garden, uh, and he did choose to dishonor his character uh, via um, Soshiro Miyako. Classic Nyx. Yeah, Luke. So we see a fan coming out of Miyako. Um, Nyx has won both the conflicts so far. We saw Travis pass his first conflict, and then we saw a clarity on the master. We're going to see Travis get an attack in here. Goes in and hits Seeker Cash. Really unfortunate. However, uh, with no fate and no courtier, we're, we, uh, Travis should be safe here to get a break. Oh, he goes water to be able to play Ningyo. Okay. So Nyx wins Earth and Void. It looks like Nyx is going to get a break here on Cash. And we're going to see Travis winning the favor. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly, Eric. Watering is not suspicious at all.
So we just see the break. Travis wins the favor. Uh, chooses military favor. Well, we see Palace and Kanjo District. <laughs> um, we we see Travis by Yuona. We see Nyx take passing fate, and then we see a Nyx saying very big brain. Travis with the quite. Um, for those who don't know what this, <laughs> those who've never experienced it before, this is what we call Kanjo Lock. And uh, basically, Kanjo District allows you to discard the Imperial favor to send a character home and bowed. And with the Imperial Palace, it's incredibly hard to lose the favor, so... <laughs> Travis is just really smart, is what it looks like. Ronnie says, look, Nyx chose his void roll. He could have chosen earth roll and had his sabotage. And we see a shrine maiden kill a shrine maiden, a court games, and a fan. Classic shrine maiden being, you know, shrine maidens hate each other. You know, you, 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 live, you live and you learn on the variants. So hitting Shameful obviously is not good either. Gives gives Nyx a fate, and then Nyx is gonna be able to activate the Shameful. Uh, Master of Gisei Toshi has targeted uh, fire, uh, Dustin.
see a tattooed wanderer with a katana. After an air attack, we see cunning magistrate come down at this palace. Bonsai and the goblin sneak. Travis chooses to discard a card at random. Discards this last shrine maiden. Really, really unlucky in that random discard there. Nyx has won a conflict. Five versus five. Uses the air ring to take an honor from Travis. The hand size disparity is really large right now, 12 to 7. Ronnie says on the bright side, his ninjas are now safe from maidens. That is true. Um, try refreshing. Travis refreshes and it works out. Okay, so he goes in at Shameful on Void. We see this Cunning Magistrate get moved in and currently blanking this uh, Master of Gisei Toshi. Let's see, we did see the break on Shameful there. It looks like... Oh, the Cunning Magistrate got Conjure Districted. Okay, that's what happened. Yeah, and not having Fate Worse Than Death is like super bad for Nyx there. Basically, Travis is... The the currently negative part about what's happening here is Travis is not getting uh, Tadaka at the moment. And that's like what would really seal the game for him, is being able to just set up Tadaka.
<laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly, Luke. But let's see. Nyx bids one, Travis bids three. So Nyx is going to try and win by Dishonor here. He has seen that he can't win otherwise against Contra District. We see a Black Mountain artist come in. Political Water. And Master is active on Earth. We see an assassination on a Solemn Scholar after we saw a way of the Scorpion to dishonor Kadaka, which... Oh, we saw an edict on a, on a Clarity. And then we saw... Core Games to honor the Black Mill Artist. Okay. We see Tattoo Wanderer going on a Mill Air. Hits Upholding Authority. We see Travis wins the conflict, upholding authority fires. We and then we see an against the waves to ready Kudaka. So Kudaka's gonna trigger here. 
Travis has consumed by five fires. Clarity. Display fine katana and three let goes. So Nyx makes him discard all three copies of let go. Uh, Travis probably should have played one of those let goes on a fan on the fan that's on the Miyako. We see a fine katana on Kadaka. Currently. Oh, okay, so Travis loses the Earth Ring. Loses a display of power to it. We're gonna get a box attack here, actually. So we're gonna have to see a fate worse than death from Nyx. I'm surprised Travis didn't just use Conjure District there. One thing I know from Travis is he's very conservative on using Conjo District. But I guess this prevents Akashiko, so you have to fate worse than death? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, but I mean, it, obviously he didn't have it then, but he, he definitely could have gotten it by now. But yeah, Nyx could also just not have Fate Worse Than Death. We see Akachiko into the conflict. We're going to see Conjure District kick her out. Most likely. Nyx could have a Hawk Tattoo also. That would work. We see... We see Travis, uh... Oh, I'm sorry. We uh, The hawk tattoo... Yeah, 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 yeah. The hawk tattoo on the Cunning Magistrate forced the Conjo, then the Kachiko kicked her out. Okay. Sorry, I'm, I'm like, doing homework while, while doing this. At least, at least I got the stream up for you guys. You're in no position to demand, Ronnie. There's no demands here. Yes, Nyx also has zero I can swim. Travis ma maintains favor. And we do see a 7 to 2 hand size. We see an Adept of the Ways and a Suki come out. I think Travis is going to just try and... So we see Shiori come out. Travis is just going to try and break here, I think. He's flipped Rally already. We're gonna see double. We're gonna see a double covert Conjo attack here. Uh, Travis bids three again. Nyx bids one. So Travis could just go for for air here if he wants. Oh no, he can't go air. He has to go water. Uh, for the for the for the adept covert, and then this lets him use a Ningyo if he has one. Yeah, he has to go water. We see Cloud the Mine on Adept of Waves. 
which means Travis was not planning on going water, because he, otherwise he should have first action used, used it. We see calling in favors on this tattooed wanderer. So now we're not going to get any covert attacks. Nyx does not have any fate for Fate Worse Than Death now. Oh, is this still draw phase? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. It's still draw phase. My bad. I didn't, I didn't see the, the chat. Travis just does a poke poke air attack actually. Now that all this has happened. Winning this would be really big. He can use it against the waves to bow Shiori. He doesn't have to worry about that. He can use Contra District on um Kachiko, so he doesn't have to worry about that. We see a storm on this Adept of Waves using uh, Kudnasala, so he's not going to flash back uh, against the waves, it looks like. So we do see we do see a forged edict on that on that uh, supernatural storm. So Travis really needs to win this conflict. <laughs> Otherwise, he's just gonna die to the Shiori. Uh, okay, so Nyx wins the conflict. Travis goes to one honor. And we're just going to see an all-in here? I don't know what Travis has to not die here. I feel like the poke attack was too aggressive. He needed to win win the air, the air ring there. Like, you need to guarantee the win, the win on the air ring there so you don't get dishonored. We see Travis's one fate is used on a clarity of purpose. Um, 
I'm pretty sure he's just dead. Why didn't he conjure this Kachiko? Huh. And that's gonna be it. Uh, Travis just like really aggressive with his bids and then he just got dishonored. So it looks like USA falls to 1-1 in the group, and uh, Singapore goes up to 2-0. Uh, they'll have the head-to-head, -head, so even if they lose, they'll probably be the number one seed. Thanks everyone for, for tuning in. Uh, hopefully we'll bring you some more action uh, moving forward.